Hi, this is Chris. Today I'm going to talk to you about how you can publish your sensory data on an MQTT broker. I will publish information about the temperature and the amount of light in my room, but the same approach can be used for any sensory data. By publishing the sensor data using an MQTT broker, the information can be made available to a number of different consumers. It could be a physical panel showing the readings on an LED display or a dashboard on a web page, and it could even be a mobile app that is available on different mobile platforms. The interesting thing is that the publishing of the data is disconnected from the consumption of the data, and that opens up many opportunities and how the data can be used. All the hardware that you need to perform this lab is the same as in my previous video called Internet of Things Sensors. So please check that out for the details. The difference this time is that I will add publication of the data to an MQTT broker so that it can be consumed by any client. So here is the Arduino code or sketch. And after the initial includes, constants for the two analog input pins are defined on line five and four and five, the MQ client object is de defined and created on line 6 and 7, followed by the declaration of a number of variables on line 8 to 12. In the setup, we initialize the bridge on line 16, which allows communication between the microcontroller and the microprocessor. And then we connect the MQTT client to the server on line 17. The internal loop starts by checking if a 5 second interval has passed, and if so, the read the value from the temperature sensor on line 25. And since that value is a raw value, it needs to be converted to a temperature using a formula. The first temperature captured to be published on line 29 is in Celsius, and the second on line 31 is in Fahrenheit. The light sensor value is read on line 32, and added to the published data on line 33. And the data is published on lines 34 to 35 to the MQTT broker. To see the published data, connect to the server with the SSH command shown here and replace with your key file and also the IP address of your server. And then you run the mosquito sub command to start a subscription to the topic Arduino sensors and where you can see the published sensor data and the output should look something like this. So that's how you can publish your sensory data on an MQTT broker. And with that, I wish you the best of luck with your Internet of Things projects. Thank you.